Hello, hello, Teacher Jewel, and welcome back. Here is another video on the Cranmer Abacus. I'm assuming at this point, if you're still with me, that you really, truly want to know how to use the abacus. You are a teacher or a parent teaching a kiddo how to use the abacus. So I hope you find these helpful. At this point, you've probably either already watched my other videos or you already know basically how to set numbers because we are going to pick straight up with adding these numbers here. So we're going to set the first number and then add the second number to it. So let's set 566. We're in the hundreds column. Remember these are the five beads up here so I could just drop that. 566. And I'm going to add 62. So we're going to go to the 10 column and we're going to add the six beads in the 10 column. One, two, three. We're out. We have to make the exchange four, five, six. And then we have to add the two, one, two. And that gives us 628. 628. All right. So let's add, let's set, well, clear first, always clear in between your problems. Now we're going to do 384. We're going to set that on our abacus, 384. We're going to add 860. All right, I worked this problem already, so follow along. There's several exchanges that we're going to make, so I'm trying to do it slow, but at the same time not too slow because then I lose my place on where I am. <laughs> so let's give it a shot. We got the first number set. We're going to add 800 to the hundreds column. So let's start counting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, so we made a couple exchanges there. Go back and look at it if you need to. Now we're going to set 60, so in the tens column we're going to set 6. Okay, 1, we're already out of beads because the 5 bead is already down, so we have to get to 6. So there was 1, make this exchange 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and then 0, we won't add anything there. So our answer is 1,244. Okay, I only have two more problems I got this off of. Um, by the way, I just took these problems straight off of a third grade math worksheet that I found online that says add three digit numbers in columns with regrouping. All right, so we're going to add 200, well not add, we're going to first clear, clear, clear. We're going to set 256, 256, and we're going to add 44. First 40 is easy, we just push up the 4. Now we have to add 4 down here. Let's count 1, 2, 3, or out. And look, we have a 99, so just like when we're counting, you get from 99, we want to go to 100. We're going to clear, clear, and then set a 100 bead. Clear, clear, set a 100. And so our answer is 3, 100. All right, last problem. 678, let's set it 678. We're going to add 89. So we're starting in the tens column. We're going to add 8 beads. 1, 2. We have to make an exchange. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And now we have to add 9 in the ones column. 1, we have to make an exchange, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So that gives us an answer of, so that's 5, 6, 7, 100, 60, 7. All right, there you go. I'll make some more videos. I'm trying to keep them short. Thanks. Bye.